Hello, everybody. Wait a few seconds to let people get on. Oh, there's someone. Hello. All right. I'm going to wait a few seconds for people to get on. Okay, here's some more people. So I'm Bethany. I'm going to be leading Compline tonight, um, and this is for the Church of the Epiphany um, in Richardson. And I want to let you know if you see like weird purple markings on my arms, I don't think you can see them, but it's because a three-year-old decided to make me a purple cheetah, not because I have a weird new tattoo. So, anyways, uh, I'm going to go ahead and get started. It is 8:01 p.m. So. This is Compline, starting now. The Lord Almighty grant us a peaceful night and a perfect end. Amen. Our help is in the name of the Lord, the people, the maker of heaven and earth. Let us confess our sins to God. Almighty God, our heavenly Father, we have sinned against you through our own fault in thought, word, and deed, and in what we have left undone. For the sake of your Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, forgive us all our offenses, and grant that we may serve you in newness of life. To the glory of your name. Amen. May the Almighty God grant us forgiveness of all of our sins, and the grace and comfort of the Holy Spirit. Amen. O God, make speed to save us. People, O Lord, make haste to help us. Together. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. And Alleluia. Now, Psalm 91. He who dwells in the shelter of the Most High abides under the shadow of the Almighty. He shall say to the Lord, You are my refuge and my stronghold, my God in whom I put my trust. He shall deliver you from the snare of the hunter, and from the deadly pestilence. He shall cover you with his pinions, and you shall find refuge under his wings. His faithfulness shall be a shield and a buckler. You shall not be afraid of any terror by night, nor any arrow that flies by day, of the plague that stalks in the darkness, nor the sickness that lays waste at midday. A thousand shall fall at your side, and ten thousand at your right hand, but it shall not come near you. Your eyes have only to behold, to see the reward of the wicked, because you have made the Lord your refuge, and the Most High your habitation. There shall be no evil happen to you, neither shall any plague come near your dwelling, for he shall give his angels charge over you, to keep you in all your ways. They shall bear you in their hands, lest you dash your foot against a stone. You shall tread upon the lion and the adder, you shall trample the young lion and the serpent under your feet. Because he is bound to me in love, therefore I will deliver him. I will protect him because he knows my name. He shall call upon me, and I will answer him. I am with him in trouble. I will rescue him and bring him to honor. With long life will I satisfy him and show my salvation. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Alright. Now, Lord, you are in the midst of us, and we are called by your name. Do not forsake us, O Lord our God. Jeremiah 14, 9, 22. The people say, thanks be to God. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. People, for you have redeemed me, O Lord, O God of truth. Keep us, O Lord, as the apple of your eye. And then people, hide us under the shadow of your wings. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. And now, Lord's Prayer. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, 
but deliver us from evil. Lord, hear our prayer, and let our cry come to you. Let us pray. Visit this place, O Lord, and drive far from it all snares of the enemy. Let your holy angels dwell with us to preserve us in peace, and let your blessing be upon us as always, through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. O oh God, your unfailing providence sustains the world we live in and the life we live. Watch over those both night and day who work while others sleep, and grant us that we may never forget that our common life depends upon each other's toil. Through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Alright. Now, if you guys would like to add prayer requests in the comments, I'll read them after. Alright. So. Guide us waking, O oh Lord, and guard us sleeping that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep we may rest in peace. Lord, you have now set your servant free to go in peace as you have promised. For those eyes of mine have seen the Savior, whom you have prepared for all the world to see, a light to enlighten the nations and the glory of your people Israel. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Guide us waking, O Lord, and guard us sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep we may rest in peace. Let us bless the Lord. People, thanks be to God. The Almighty and merciful Lord, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, bless us and keep us. Amen. So, now I'm going to go to the prayer request, and last time this is where I spontaneously cut off because I refreshed the page. And now I know that I can go on my phone and do it that way and not destroy everything. So, let's see if I can. I think I can go on my phone. Ah, there we go. Right? Why can't I do this? Nope, now I'm now playing myself. Oh. Yep. Okay. Where, how do I get to the comments? I need practice with Facebook. <laughs> so, anyways. Do it that way. Comment. Oh, there we go. Alright, so, we have Lebanon. Okay. Lord, I pray that you help Lebanon and all the people who are in, have died and who are suffering and are injured. I help you hope you help the first responders find everybody and help everybody and I pray also for our schools and that they uh, when they reopen everything will go well and I pray that people don't get coronavirus and that everyone suffering from coronavirus is lifted up and that um, the uh, people under financial burden are also given relief from that. Amen. Thank you guys. I will see you next time. Have a very peaceful night. Bye-bye.